Hello everyone, we are going to begin with a weather report. It's been raining. However, we can always have sunshine in our hearts with our song. And there is nothing better than singing about rainbows. After all, rainbows come after the rain. Please join my spring sing during quarantine Facebook group. Post your videos of you singing to our group. It's now news from the playground. I know so many of you parents are Missing the playground. entertain your families with amazing skills. Just think of it as the playground needing a rest. We are so grateful to all our hospital, postal, supermarkets, and all essential workers who are taking care of us and keeping us safe and healthy. And now for a special segment, Hitting Heroes. This segment celebrates people you might not be thinking about, and yet they help keep our community going. Our first set of Hitting Heroes are the people who are making sure that teachers can keep teaching their students so the learning never stops. We are now going to the Buffalo Public Schools to learn how they are making this happen. My name is Sarah Edwards and I'm the Director of Instructional Technology for the Buffalo Public Schools. My work involves supporting teachers and students in the use of technology for their learning. City District, we are actually the second largest school district in the state of New York. We have over 33,000 students and we work with uh, 3,600 teachers. I am lucky to have a fantastic team to help support all of these teachers and students. We have a team of 30 teachers who are called instructional technology coaches. And their job is to work with the teachers to help them find the best ways to roll technology into their lessons. We also have 30 staff who work in the information technology department because our district uses technology for everything. On top of that, we have another 15 people who work just as tech support, and they are always busy trying to keep all of our devices up and running. What are some things that are different now that we are in quarantine? 
A lot has changed for both the staff and students in the Buffalo Public Schools. Now we are working, teaching, and learning from home. We are very lucky to have those 30 instructional technology coaches. They have been working around the clock trying to help teachers find the best way to connect with their students. When we closed school on Friday, March 13th, we had no idea that we would be closed this long. So our students in grades three through eight left their devices at school. So now we had to make a plan to get those 14,000 devices back into the hands of kids. What is one of the challenges you face? I think the biggest challenge in supporting our staff has been in trying to help teachers learn to use new technology through the use of technology. Our coaches and other support staff through the district have been working through video conference and phone calls and email and text messages, trying to help answer questions so the teachers feel like they can try new things and they have someone to help. Can you describe something positive you have seen come out of this new situation. I've seen some really positive things come out of this experience. One of the best is seeing teachers willing to try new things. It's really very apparent how much the teachers care about their students and how much they want to connect with them. And so teachers who were maybe a little shy about trying out a new technology have put their fears to the side because the most important thing to them is making sure that they are there for their students. The best thing about my job is seeing the creative things that teachers and students do with the technology and knowing that I might have had some small part in helping provide the opportunity. My mom is one of the instructable technology coaches. I reached out to some of her coworkers. What I enjoy most about being an instructional technology coach during the COVID-19 quarantine is being able to connect with so many different teachers to help them feel more comfortable and adjust to this newer way of teaching. Hey Reagan, I'm your mom's friend Brian. Uh, I'm an instructional technology coach in Buffalo Public Schools. The thing I like best uh, during this quarantine about being an ITC is problem solving. Uh, I like complicated puzzles. Um, I like trying to work out things that are challenging and uh, nothing is more challenging at a time right now than troubleshooting issues, um, helping teachers navigate new programs, um, and helping students uh, get accustomed to learning online. Thank you so much, Miss Edwards, and to all of the responsible technology coaches and information support staff for all you do to keep students learning. You truly are heroes. I am introducing a segment called Inspiration to Live By. I hope you find these words confident in these uncertain times. The Lord is close to broken hearted and he saves those who are crushed in spirit. Now, Go make some good news. Thank you for watching.